guys so today has been like a drastically long day and we just got back from benny's dentist appointment because oh my gosh that's like a whole nother story i have to tell you guys you guys know that benny has like two cavities right well these same two cavities keep on freaking falling out and then we have to like redo these cavities like every other month it's so freaking annoying but anyways so we just got back from the dentist and then i had to drop benny off at the barber shop to get his hair cut with edward because do you guys know it's on Aaliyah's birthday weekend so everybody has to look their best and i think either today or tomorrow night i'm gonna go get a pedicure with the girls i'm not really sure when i'm gonna do that but i need to do that soon either today or tomorrow and then i need to refill my nails to you guys but after we drop Benny off, it's just me and Viviana, and we decided to have like a little girls' day. And we stopped at Nothing Bundit Cakes. Viviana already took the um in the bag. Look, it's so fire! Let me know in the comments down below, down below if you guys have tried them. I love their confetti cakes, and then I love confetti anything. Like even if we like bake cakes at home, like I am absolutely in love with confetti. I don't care what it is, that's like my favorite flavor of cake any day is confetti. And then um, Viviana got, Viviana just got back in the car because they did not give us any forks. So Viviana had to- fork. I was looking. She had to run inside and get us some forks. So Viviana, what kind did you get again? Chocolate, 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 chocolate chip. chip. Mm, is that your favorite? I like chocolate. Yeah, Viviana likes chocolate anything. Like, if you want to get to her heart, like, the key to her heart is chocolate. I'm not even kidding. It's chocolate, it's, what else is it? Um, Red velvet, that's her, that's the key to her heart, you guys. If you guys ever make her mad, get that girl some chocolate or some red velvet. Oh my God, it smells so good. So there's one of those moments where like, me and Viviana are just having like a date to herself in the car. Spending like quality time with you guys. It's kind of quiet. And the other kids don't get nothing. <laughs> yeah. So we always have to hide the evidence. Yeah. So like we'll probably like throw this away whenever we're done. But we, we will finish it because we're not going to waste it. I have no idea why, but somebody sent all these boxes to my house. And there's like. Are you I am serious. Somebody sent all these boxes to my house and I don't know what I'm going to do with them. No, he said he was like yelling at me for ordering them. I was like, bro, I did not order these. What are you doing? That's so weird that somebody would send all these boxes to my house. Like, what am I gonna do with all these boxes? We were supposed to do like a prank or something with them. I don't know. Or he's been wanting like a present or like a package or something. So maybe we could prank her and like put her name on it or like print a sticker and put her name on it. Hmm. And then we're gonna be like, Analia, uh, don't go in mom's room. There's a present. <gasps> we should test her to see, see if she's, if she's gonna like, open her gonna present. Open. Ah, is that a good idea? You guys let me know in the comments down below if you guys I'm think so that's a good idea. I'm so smart. But we still have like a hundred other boxes. So what the heck, look. Each of these literally have like, have, like 50 of them. Yeah, like 20 boxes in each one. Like, what the heck am I gonna do with, who sent all these boxes? That's like weird. There's like a mysterious a person boxes. sending mysterious boxes because we don't even know why to our freaking house what i don't have room for this we're gonna have to put them in the storage room mm -hmm. want some noodles those ones guys you should get them these are Viviana's like bombies.com because i made her stop sorry it's dark we gotta open the windows my life i made her stop you guys know that this girl can literally max these nuclear noodles she eats these for like a snack and then they mess up her stomach so bad and i know there was like a thing going around about them messing up kids stomachs yes it's true because every time Viviana eats those she's up all night with stomach pain so i told her she cannot eat those anymore she switched to these ones because she loves noodles although i am gonna do like a family spicy nuclear challenge that's what i bought those for well it's not what i bought those for i actually bought those for Viviana. But because she can't use them anymore, I told him we were gonna use them to do a family channel or a family challenge. And then she's not gonna be able to partake in that challenge because no! it's coming. Out. So she's Can probably gonna be like the recorder for us. Sorry. Okay guys, so we're back home now and my mom's singing in the car. And my I sister. And my sister's taking pictures. Did you guys see the new Selena I'm making Gomez song? TikTok. My sister's making TikToks because she's just like so so self conserved. So self-conserved. That's a good thing to be self-conserved, honey. 
Hey, did you guys hear the new, uh, I said, hey, like they're gonna talk to me back. Did you guys hear the new Selena Gomez? It's not new, but it's new to me. The new Selena Gomez song, I love it. Calm down. Hey, hey, hey. Did you hear it? No. All right, I'm about to put it on for you. Anyways, guys, so we're home now, and I just got home from school, and I'm looking good. I kind of am, though. Today was kind of a good day because, like, my makeup was good, my lips were good, and I was like, you know what, today's actually a good day. And some things made my day bad, but every time it would go bad, I was like, at least I look good. So it would make my day go back up. And you guys are all supposed to be confident. So I don't want nobody on this post. I don't want to be she's so cute. She is cute. And you guys have to be confident like that too. You guys have to be cute like that too. Well, so. I don't look good all the time, guys. It was, just, it was basically like, it's like once in a while. And today was one, the one time in a while. So I do feel like you look good all the time though. Oh, thanks. Yeah. So and Viviana looks good all the time. Even look at, look at her back there. <laughs> but yeah guys so we're gonna go home i'm gonna go inside and eat and yeah because i don't eat school hey did you send boxes to our house be honest what? yeah like a crap little boxes as a prank or something mm -hmm. somebody's flying here somebody's sus and i don't know who it is who's sending box boxes when you walk in there watch there's like a crap little boxes whose <laughs> airpods are you wearing mom must be nice to have some AirPods, guys. My family doesn't love me. I don't have AirPods. They're my mom. I love her enough that she's had four pairs. That means she can... And I bought two. And I bought two. <laughs> yeah, guys. But my birthday's coming up, so. Ah. I bought you a hey. gift. Ah. I got you a gift. I got you more than you got me last year. Oh, for real? Yes, for real. We're going to tell her my birthday's coming up. I was ready to go look for the elf. Me. You? Benny, you're not ready to look for the elf? Benny just woke up. He took a nap, you guys. Edward said he always falls asleep when he gets his hair cut. Does it feel good when you cut your hair? Yeah, it does. It feels like a massage. Um, This morning, the kids and I have time to go look for the elf. So that's what they're going to do now. For those of you guys that don't know, I know a lot of you guys do know, but for those of you guys that do not know, our elf will... Our elf comes every year on December 1st and then he stays for 30 days and he helps Santa make sure they are doing good and they stay on the naughty list. Every night he flies back to the North Pole to tell Santa if they've been bad or good and the kids are not allowed to touch him otherwise he loses his powers to go back to the North Pole. Guys, so we do have this elf dust that makes him So if they crazy. accidentally touch him they can sprinkle elf dust on him and it's, it almost like revives him. Are you guys ready? Are you ready to go look for the elf? Let's go look for him. Come on, let's go look for the elf, guys. I know we were sitting in the living room, so he's not in there. Let's go. Let's go first. Let's check the line. Where is he? Check the line. Where him. is he? Back up, baby. Oh my gosh, Back what is up. it? It's going to explode. Ah! <laughs> oh, he's cool, guys. Oh, okay, out. okay, okay, okay. Right, you check your room? He's not in the laundry room, Benny? He's not in there, you check. You didn't go in the laundry room. <laughs> What if he's hiding? Take you see him? No, nothing? Nothing. 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 What if he's in Viviana's room? You think, he, you think he's in your room? But I woke up this morning, he wasn't in my room. Oh, that's no. not really good morning. Job. What about my Babe, room? did you cut Benny's no. hair super short? It looks super short for some reason. Yeah, I cut it shorter. Why? Yeah, it looks good like that. No, I don't. You should always cut it how we always cut it. Mm. Why didn't you cut your shorter? Mine is. I cut it shorter too. Don't touch my son's head. When I send him that to get a haircut. Son. I'm sorry. Huh, baby? Now your head's going to be cold. No, it's not. Hey, hey, it's my elf too. You see it? No, oh, nothing? Oh, Why is this paperwork all over the bed? Because I need to buy a filing cabinet. That's why. <laughs> all right. Or our, no, no? Check our bathroom. Come on, come on. Let's see, in the closet, anything, nothing? Nothing. Anything, nothing? What about the other one? Anything? In the doors. In the closet. Ah! Oh, I thought you found it, you scared me. The shower. Anything? Look under the covers. Ah! Oh! Ah! What is what? that? I thought, I thought. Oh there. my I thought Bloody goodness. Mary was here. Oh my goodness! Let me open the 
That's so cute. They're taking okay. a bubble bath. Oh, is that a bubble bath? In Benny's bathtub. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Yeah, can let I Benny read it. Let Benny read one, you can read the other. I'm back. And then what does Buddy's message say? And I brought a friend of her. Name is, is Winter. She do shy. No, no she she's is here, here to stay. Stay. So you better be good. Okay. Wow. And then what does Winter say? So that's our new elf. Her name's Winter. We've never had her hey, before. Hey, Winter. She's a That's girl. Jingles and that's Buddy. Buddy's so what does Winter's... Um, we can only touch Buddy, though. No, no, you can't. Can't. no we, we can only can touch Jingle. Jingle. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Can you don't I know the Winter? elf rules? Nah, I said you can't touch Jingles. No, you can. No, you cannot. I mean, you cannot touch Buddy. Oh, okay. Okay, listen, listen. Right. He says, I know hi. Hi, I'm Winter. I'm Santa's second pair of eyes. I'm excited to be a part of the family. I heard we are YouTubers. Is That's going to be fun. Can't wait. Wow. Guys. Look at the little snowman. Now you guys got to be on your best behavior because they're... This like makeup. They're flying back and forth to the North Pole every time. Every night. Hi. I don't have a lot of lipstick left, you guys. And it's a girl and I've been wanting a girl out for so long. No offense to Buddy. Buddy. But look, I know it's a girl because he doesn't have lipstick and Kobe. she does. And like That's so, so cute. What do you think, Benny? Oh. Are you excited? I love her. Huh? Are you excited? Yeah. And we always <laughs> have Buddy, which is we can touch him so I don't bring him with me. That's jingles. That's not oh, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Pajama party, but no You're having a pajama party at school? Benny, I mean, Jingles used to have a little thingy with yeah, bell. Oh, yeah, a bell. Yeah, a little bell heart call. bell with like magic in it, but we're allowed to touch him. He doesn't lose his magic. It's just um, a little capture just in case. That is so cute. And so, like, this took me forever. What? Wow. This is a lot of fun. It took you forever to find? Yeah, we were looking this morning and we had to leave to school, so it took me forever to get home. Come on, buddy. Um, can I take a balloon out there? I, no, he, leave him in here. He, I know where you got him. I got him. You got him from the laundry room. I saw him in the laundry room. <laughs> I didn't get him nowhere. He came over here from the laundry room. That's not the laundry room, Benny. It's uh, Lizzie's outfit. Look. Off the shelf. Look. He what? No, he moved off no, the shelf. No, it was this guy. I he didn't move here. him off the shelf. He yeah, moved at night time. Right no, I took him off. Because you're allowed to touch him, so I took him off the oh, shelf. Why didn't you guys find him this morning? Well, I didn't move because him. Because we had to leave to school. Alright guys, so I'm waiting for Edward because me and Edward were talking. We decided to give Analia a early birthday gift. And it's something she's been wanting for a long time. But I'm kind of nervous because I think she might not like it because... I got it in rose gold, and she told me the other day that she don't like rose gold, and I was like, what? I just got this in rose gold, because I thought it was cute. But so the time I walk up to so her, she told me she didn't like rose gold after I bought it, so now I'm like, what if she don't like it? So, we're just gonna see you guys. What? This is how I'm gonna walk up to her. Give it to her like that. Are you ready? I can't believe my baby's turning 15. 15, guys. One, five. I'm so sad. All right, let's go. Wait, you gotta hide the bag. She's gonna know what it is. Put it behind your bag. All right, we're, we're gonna give Analia early um, uh, birthday present. Did I say Christmas gift? I meant birthday present, you guys. So, because you guys know her birthday's in what? Your birthday's in what, Analia? <laughs> your birthday's in what? Three days? Yeah. All right. Are you ready? Are you? Ready? Yeah. What is it? I can not see it! I can not see it! You guys, we got David in the cut. He's in the kitchen cooking. David, say hi. All right, ready? Go. <gasps> Let's see if she likes it. Drum AirPods. Roll. AirPods. AirPods. No AirPods. No, they are AirPods. They are AirPods? Yeah. <sighs> Oh, those are the pros! Ready? The pros, Benny? <laughs> he really like thinks it's pros. AirPods. 
Yeah. It looked like an AirPod box, though. Yeah, this. Those are nicer than my mom's. Boy, I'm nice. What did you say? Those are nicer than my mom. <laughs> it's Bye. so cute. Are you sure? The other day you told me you didn't like rose gold. I know I did. But it does look nice though. It is. It's nice. It's cute. Are you sure? We can yeah. take it back. It's if it's, if I don't want this because my other jewelry is like all rusted because oh, they're fake, so they turn rose gold anyway. So okay. Hey, I want blue. What? I'm talking about the Billy I bought, guys. Huh. She got the rose gold heart, and then we got her. We got you the moon because I know you're like getting into like zodiac signs and stuff like that. And then we got you this one, and it has the suitcase, a globe, an airplane because we travel a lot and like we love to travel. And then you could just keep adding on there. I was looking for a, a number 15 for your 15th birthday, but they were sold out. I guess everybody's getting them for their 15th birthday. So I just opened my gift and it, the Pandora bracelet. And guys, it's the first bracelet in the front you guys see. It's the rose gold one with the sparkly on it. It's so cute. I love it, guys. It's so cute, guys. It's literally like the cutest thing ever. And I've been begging my parents. Like, I want a Pandora bracelet so bad. And they finally gave it to me for an early birthday gift, guys. Early birthday gift. My birthday's in three days. So that means I still have another gift. And I'm so excited. I'm so excited. And I'm so thankful and grateful that my parents got me my Pandora bracelet. Because I love them so much. But, yeah, guys. It's so cute. Look. You guys, so since our only birthdays in three days, or what did we say, two days, I had to move the tree because we're throwing a big birthday party here. So I had to move the tree in the corner right there for now. And then, don't mind the floor is dirty, we're sweeping. I think we're gonna put like a table and chairs right here. I'm gonna remove all of that Christmas stuff, for, use that for a cake table, and then I'm gonna get rid of the mirror. We're gonna put like a balloon garland. And then, sorry, sorry you guys, the vacuum just turned on. And then we're gonna, you know, be able to sit there on the couch and then the table here. The older kids are probably gonna be downstairs just hanging out. The, the younger kids are probably gonna be up here in Benny's room. So, right now it is late. Me and Ali are gonna get ready for the gym. Savannah, are you ready for bed, my love? No. No? You look like it. All comfy on the couch. I'm comfy, but I'm not ready for are you ready for the gym? Go get your gym clothes on. Okay guys, so I'm gonna I'm getting ready to go to the gym now. So I'm gonna wipe my makeup off first and then I'm gonna just put like something like on or I don't know, I might just take this little sweater off because I already got a leggings and hoodie on. So I mean I guess that's gym material because I don't really feel like doing too much today because I'm a little bit tired and I kinda didn't want to go to the gym, but I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna go anyways. So yeah, I'm just gonna take my makeup off real quick. And look guys, look at all my clean clothes back there. Oh, in my bed. It's not made. Don't look at that. It looks so bad. My room looks so plain. Like, it's like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, it looks so plain. Like, it needs to be decorated. And my mom's been trying to get me to decorate my room for the longest. And, I mean, I do and I don't. Like, it's like, because it's a lot of work. I mean, it's not a lot of work, but, like, I don't know how to redecorate it because I'm just such a plain person. And then I saw on TikTok, it was like, how your room looks is how you are. And I was like, I said to my mom, I was like, plain. And I was like, plain in a mess. <laughs> and she was like, we're going to redecorate your room soon. I was like, oh, okay. Oh, okay. So, yeah, guys, I'm just going to take my makeup off. Because I don't like wearing makeup to the gym. Because, first of all, I feel like it makes me break out. And second of all, it makes me feel so nasty because, like, I'm sweating and stuff. So, I feel like nobody wears makeup to the gym, right? Or do you guys wear makeup to the gym? I mean, if you do, then I guess it's okay. I mean, yeah. Because it's like you, you know? But like me personally, I take my makeup off. It just makes me feel icky when I get back. And I just want to hurry up and get in the shower and go to sleep when I get back. Can I wear this to them? I think I can. Oh, yeah. About to get my butt plump. Just kidding, guys. I'm so sorry. Mom cut that out. That was so embarrassing. Okay. Bye, guys.